Yellow Wave One Dexto here, and welcome to City Skylines. And today we're building an intercity bus metro train station hub. So let's get to it. So with a blank canvas here, close to your train line, we'll come into our medium roads here and select our four lane road with decorative trees. And with that, we're gonna create sort of a centerpiece plaza for this intercity hub. So we'll just lay down a distance of 1280 to begin with, like so. And then we'll come into our small roads here and we'll use the two lane road with the trees, right? And on each side, we're gonna come up by distance of 420. All right, cool. Let's come, let's come a little bit closer here. We're gonna do the same below as well, 420 on each side. And then in the space, we're gonna come into our parks with our city parks and choose the park plaza, all right? And we'll put it down here on either side, smack dab in the middle, all right? And then with our zoo plaza, we'll put it down over here in the corner, leaving a tile between for, uh, for a path, all right? Cool, that should be good. And then we'll come into our paths here. I'm gonna select our park path because I think it's it's a nice looking path. So we're gonna come here on the on the fourth tile from the road, right? And this is where we'll start. And with our lowest elevation steps selected, we'll come up by three, all right? On either side. Let's come down again and then up by three. Cool. And then we'll come over. Ah, okay. See, so very important that we put these exactly in the middle. So let's replace this, all right? There. It's a shame it doesn't snap, but hey, we'll make it work. So back to our path and we'll drag it over to the other side of the road and then come down by three again. And we'll do the same over here. Cool. So here we have a little centerpiece, all right? And then up here, let's lay down some road. I think this ended up being more than 420, so I'm gonna rebuild this really quickly. And up by 420, there you go. Then with our tree road, we'll come in here by distance of 300 on either side. And then I'm gonna select our bicycle lane, uh, our road with bicycle lane, and finish it up. Now the reason I do that is to have this crossing, all right? Uh, the crossing right where the path is. And we'll do the same down here. So 300 on either side and then bicycle road there. Cool. So up here, let's put down a metro station. So let's come into our two lane road with trees again. And we'll grab this node right here and we'll come up by a distance of 300. All right. And this is going to be the snapping point of our metro station. So let's come into public transport here and we'll go to content creator packs and we'll select the elevated island platform metro station. Cool. All right. This is from the from the train station content creator pack by Bad Peanut. All right. Absolutely beautiful asset. And as you can see, it it snaps perfectly central here. All right. Nice. That's going to be perfect. All right. Let's come back into our two lane roads with the trees, and we'll just take this out by a distance of two hundred and forty, and we can go up by three hundred. Yeah. So we're gonna do this on either side, and this is just to frame this in, all right? And as you can see, if, if you can see it, it snaps to the road that we laid in first. Cool, perfect. So we'll come into our transport, and we'll go over to public transport hubs, and we'll take our bus intercity bus hub, right? And we'll just place this down centralized, right? Cool, perfect. And then we can frame this in as well, of course, if we want to. Uh, this is not necessary, I just like to frame my assets in with roads. However, let's turn our attention to down here where we'll place our train station. We'll come into transportation here, over to content creator packs again, and then we'll choose this one, the ground dual island platform train station. I think it's the longest name of any asset in City Skylines, but it's beautiful, all right? And we'll place this, it, it can be a little finicky with the snapping, but if we place it here centralized like so, can see how beautiful this asset actually is. It's absolutely stunning. So over here, I think I want a bridge to run over the train tracks, all right? Think the old original town road meeting, meeting this new and modern intercity bus train metro station hub, all right? 
So let's come into our roads here and we'll go over to our content content creator packs, the bridges and piers. And we'll take the European two lane stone bridge. It's an absolutely beautiful, beautiful road this. So we'll come to this corner right here. And with our curved tool select, we'll come out by five. All right. And then with lowest elevation step selected, we'll come up by four, like by three, excuse me. So, and then back to straight road and we'll come over just like this, All right? And this can just continue out. Cool. So this is a beautiful, beautiful road. I really love this. Actually, come to think of it, maybe we want this cobblestone pedestrian path running along here. So let's, let's take a look at how that would be. So come into our upgrade tool here and let's, let's just see. Yeah, I think I like that. Let's keep that. Actually, let's do that over here as well. Like so. Yeah, that's nice. Of course, we're going to lose our pedestrian path here, but that's fine. We have one here. That'll be okay. Yeah, wow, that's super pretty. Let's keep it like that. And then we can expand a little bit here and maybe even talk about a little bit of, of detailing. So let's come back into our tree road here and we'll just drag this out a little bit here just to give us a little bit of space, all right? And then down here, I'm thinking a little corner cafe, right? Maybe with a public bathroom as well. So let's let's take a look at this. So parks and plazas, we'll take our cafe here and shoot it down here and then maybe a bathroom here. Perfect, super pretty, all right? People coming off the train, they can grab a coffee and then go over and grab the bus or the metro. And then up here, let's fill this out a little bit, all right? Let's, I'm, I'm thinking a grass road maybe to continue out here, like so. And then maybe we'll put in a path here, cool. And let's put some offices here, all right? I'm thinking a four by four office there. And then we'll come back and see how that, how that looks. And then over here, we'll do somewhat the same. Maybe we'll just select a normal road here. Maybe frame it in like this and zone out some offices here also. And we can actually do the same down here, right? We can zone out some offices here and then frame that in. That's, that'll be nice. Perfect. And as always, I'll be very specific with what assets grows in. Um, but yeah, I'll be right back. And we're back. So I actually decided to change this out with uh, with high density commercial. These are two by four assets in the modern city center content creator pack. And I really like the look of this asset. All right. It adds to the feel that, you know, this is modern. And then over here is sort of the, the older original towns and streets, right? This is a four by four office asset. Uh, very, very beautiful corner asset, as you can see. And if, if we're specific enough with how the, we we let this grow in, we can get this sort of um, double corner asset uh, spice going on here. Cool. And then over here, this is also, this is a four by four office. Uh, very, very pretty corner asset, right? And if we want, we can even go ahead and frame this in. Wait, here we go. There. Cool. Perfect. That's super nice. Let's let's talk about these sort of derpy looking vanilla trees, all right? So we can actually change this, right? If we come into our landscaping and disasters, I guess, yeah. Go to our content creator trees. And I'm thinking a rhododendron here, which is just, it's such a pretty little bush, right? Maybe even here and here. Let's take a look at that. Yeah, I like that. That's perfect. Super pretty. However, that is going to do it for me today. If you enjoyed the video, which I really hope you did, please don't forget to leave a like. And as always, if you have any suggestions for what you would like to see me build next, let me know in the comments below. And also, I have been thinking about starting a series of a, um, of a city, of a, of a complete city build. If you would be interested in, in building a city together, um, with a series here on YouTube, let me know in the comments below. Uh, but for now, enjoy the rest of your day, evening or night, and see you next time.
Bye bye.